and know how to explain how this feels. It's, uh, it's totally new, totally different. I've never felt anything like it before. This is the latest suspension system that you can add to a road or a gravel bike. Are they worth the price tag? Well, we'll get to that. So I've fitted and tested these products over the last couple of weeks and I've got some super interesting findings to share with you. These have completely transformed my gravel bike, giving me not only more comfort, but also more speed. How is that possible? Well, we'll get into all of that in just a little minute. But first, what actually are these things? So this is a suspension stem and this is a suspension seat post. And they're both made by this super interesting company called Redshift Sports. They're like an engineering company and they make really random and unique cycling components. The whole point of these things is to bring a little bit of suspension to a rigid framed bike, like a road bike or a gravel bike. In theory, giving you a little bit more comfort at two key touch points, the handlebars and the saddle. But can you actually feel a difference? Do these things feel good? Do they feel bad? Do they feel weird? Well, we're gonna find all of that out. But first, let's get these fitted to my bike. That was easy. <laughs> That's the seat post done. me done super easy installation let's get out and see what these things are like okay so we've got the parts fitted onto the bike I've come out beautiful evening I'm gonna do a sort of typical gravel loop that I normally do lots of different terrains gonna give this thing a proper test and I'm um, gonna give you my first impression see if I think it's worth it worth the money and see if I'm gonna keep it on my bike for the foreseeable future I'm really excited to try this one I have ridden a little bit already and um, it does feel really interesting but I'll give you my full thoughts in a minute. Okay, I'm out here on the gravel trails. It's um, also very windy this evening, so uh, I apologise about that. I'm not quite sure I know how to explain how this feels. It's, uh, it's totally new. I've never felt anything like it before. It's not quite like normal suspension. It feels different, but it's an absolute joy to ride. It feels so good. You know if you've forgotten to pump your tyres up for a few days and you get that really comfortable, soft feeling. That is basically what this bike feels like. But my tyres are not soft and I am moving at speed. It feels like the fastest mountain bike I've ever ridden. <laughs> it's fast and it's comfortable, which are just two things that normally don't go together. It's definitely taken a little bit of getting used to though because it does feel strange. I'm having to adapt. But I think I like it. So both the stem and the seat post feel kind of unique and different in their own ways, really. The stem, you can definitely feel it moving. Like, you can feel the travel, but it's not disorientating. Like, it's not distracting. It doesn't affect your handling or anything like that. You just feel it. But I think the most, like, resounding feeling I'm getting is just confidence. Like, confidence to be able to hit stuff. Usually when I'm out gravel riding, I'm trying to choose a line just because I don't want to hit something, slow down, all that kind of stuff. But with this, I'm just hitting stuff <laughs> and it feels absolutely fine. The seat 
post is a lot more subtle. You don't really feel it working that much. It's kind of just working behind the scenes. Like you can definitely feel it moving a little bit, but it's not as noticeable as the stem. I've just ridden over a section that is super bumpy. And usually if I'm seated, the saddle kind of pops me off the saddle all the time. And I sort of lose control a little bit and I have to get back onto the saddle. But with this, my like bum stayed connected to the saddle the whole time just because it has that flex in it and so I really noticed it there I think you definitely have to work on getting the right saddle position there's a little bit of sag a bit of flex that I can feel but the thing is when you combine both of them together you just get this really nice suspension without it feeling really noticeable it's wonderful okay this is a super interesting product I've honestly never experienced anything like this before. Quick disclaimer, Redshift did send me these products free of charge, um, which is an absolute privilege, but they didn't ask me to make any sort of positive review. So everything that I say is fully my own opinion, and if they were rubbish, I would tell you that if they were rubbish. So yeah, just thought I'd let you know. It genuinely is innovative, and it's genuinely comfortable, and it makes me more confident in the bike. It makes me want to hit bumps more. It makes me faster over difficult terrain. First impressions are exceptionally good. It's definitely going to take some time to get used to. There's definitely some bike fit things that I'm thinking about. You know, is the saddle changing my saddle height too much? You know, am I going to feel it at certain points, like being super um, soft here, like when I'm sprinting? I did do a little sprint and it didn't feel that noticeable, but I need to test this more. I think what I'm excited about is the prospect of doing a much longer event on this stuff because over like 100, 200 kilometers, you really do get like the fatigue buildup of all the bumps and all the terrain and you get sore and tired. And this could potentially save you from getting like super fatigued. You could have more energy, arrive at the event in better conditions or do it faster. And so I need to test this out. First impressions are good but I'm gonna do a lot more testing on this um, over the next months as I do different events and going through the winter and then I will share some more full thoughts then. But Redshift, I'm impressed. Will I keep it on my bike forever? I don't know yet. I need to figure that out. I really like the stem. The seat post maybe needs to grow on me a little bit. It's the first ride and that is just some first impressions. Well done, Redshift. If you want to see my full review when I release that, make sure you subscribe down below. It genuinely means a lot to me. Um, it helps me to get products like this, to test them. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. Cheers.